Now, in a bid to provide trauma care and uh, psychological support to survivors of sexual and gender-based violence in the Katina community, International Art, in collaboration with the Ministry of Human Services and the Social Development has trained community first responders to create agencies, safe space facilitators, the state uh, human rights commission and community leaders. The training now uh, focuses on uh, uh, psychosocial first aid skills to support survivors in the Kujay uh, Juji and also Maraban Rido communities of uh, Chicken Lokigami area. As the Lua Midari, the training facilitator, stresses the importance of more agencies, organizations, and individuals receiving psychological first aid training. Not equipped with the right skill to provide the care needs of the survivors. This training aims to bring the network of first responders together so that when there is an event of SGBV, collectively and within the referral pathways, survivors get the required services that they need within the referral pathways, ensuring that survivors are not exposed to further harm. Because when a case is reported and it goes to the wrong person, for instance, it jeopardizes justice, it jeopardizes the mental health also of the survivors. So this training is bringing all stakeholders together to ensure that we have a uniform referral pathways, collecting data, ensuring that even while we collect information from survivors, we respect their right to privacy, we enhance their dignity as well as their safety. Uh, participants said the training was highly relevant and expanded their ability to offer professional PFA support to SGBV survivors without causing undue distress. More people should hear and know how to administer psychological first aid, especially for sexual and gender-based violence survivors. These survivors go through a lot of trauma, and if they can, if their first meeting point, wherever it is, they render or administer psychological first aid to them, then the beginning of their healing has started. So I feel like more agencies, more organizations, more people should be equipped with the skills for psychological first aid. And it is important to also put them stable to be able to access other helps. And from that point, know what other helps that will be important for them. Plans on how to, um, in case anything should have administered the psychological um, um, first aid. That it's not something that only a trained personnel can do, even us too. Even be it not in the hospital, I can administer it anyway. Maybe the place is secured, safer for the survivor. So I'm very happy because I'm in this training, it helped me a lot. Back to my community, I will do step down training for the down ones to know the importance of uh, breaking silence. If they see anything, they talk. If they have any problem, they should uh, report. So Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.